he saw this video. <laughs> oh! <laughs> This world is full of predators. They prey on the innocent. The one who are, who are the most unknowing are children. Predators could be our neighbors, our school teachers, even people with money, powerful, and our churches. Constantly talk with your kids about boundaries and what they shouldn't do or whatever. Weren't you the, weren't you the one who was drunk? Chill. Chill, 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 chill. I ain't doing this. Weren't you the one that. who proudly stated that she was okay putting Molly on in a champagne? So that's what she's saying. That you, I mean, you recall that. You recall that. Of course. You, yeah. So now, now she has a response because y'all. I think what's happening. People are just missing the correlation, right? They're missing the correlation. And Cardi B is now going to explain to us thoroughly. That's not really predatory behavior. Drugging men. Oh. Men, that's not predatory behavior. So I put the tweet up, right? I put the tweet up, and now people want to come at me like. Oh, bitch, you're the wrong messenger. You're the wrong messenger. Then you robbing drug men. And it's like, listen, listen, listen. Y'all not going to keep doing this because when it comes to fucking weird ass predators and rapists and pedophiles and shit, I'm really like, I'm really like, I don't play that shit. I really don't fucking play that shit. And for y'all to like trying to say that I'm like some predator or I'm some real <laughs> bitch because niggas wanted to buy pussy from me. And a lot of y'all be like, oh, these were vulnerable men you took advantage of. These were not no fucking vulnerable men. These are some freak ass niggas that like to go to the strip club, that like to get drunk. And after you go after the fucking club is closed, they trying to fucking take advantage of bitches and trying to bargain. No, nigga. I'm going to go through them fucking pockets. And and then y'all be like, so you can rob them. Did I this touch their body? Worse. Did I touch their penis? Did I touch their ass? Did I touch Just them? Did them. I put my lips on? Uh, yeah, def that, definite. By definition, you drug them. I'm not even going to lie. Regardless of all of, if you did all those other things or not, which I don't even want to know, it's still not good. And this video is now gonna be on top of the other video. Ah oh, man, bad PR, yo. She don't got nobody in her corner. She just let the internet do what they do. From them, no, no type of fucking touching. Don't confuse. And even if y'all claim, oh, you robbed them, what's robbing and uh, robbing and robbing is two different type of shit. So don't fucking call me no bitch. Don't fucking no fucking drugging. Don't fucking play. If you would have robbed them, that'd have been one thing. Drugging them. And because of that tweet, people talking about like, oh, but you the wrong messenger. How am I the wrong messenger, bitch? I'm the right messenger because I'm a fucking mom. Bro, the arguments. The, yeah, we skipped over. <laughs> they sound so good. I, in her <laughs> mind, it does. In her mind, she's like, uh, bro, stop it, bro. Yeah, it's not the same. Yeah, I and get what she's saying. Honestly. Like, like, bro, but you was being predatory. But check it out, though. Like, it was how was I really being predatory? How bro? Is like, it, it was really? drug him. If I just drug him, and robbed him. Drug him and take advantage I didn't of him in their pocket. I didn't touch him. I just if you would have, yo, that's it, if you would have just not have went back with them, you could have easily just said no. It's the whole. You went through the whole initial thing of tricking him, drugging him, and then robbing. Very, it's, 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 it's too many steps. <laughs> You're doing too much. It's very, it's very, uh, yeah. I, don't, I just I don't drugged really them. I, they wanted one thing. I think I the, dr the drug wanted. is the biggest uh, part. We agreed upon the thing that they wanted. <laughs> and what I really wanted, though, was in pocket. So what I decided to do is I drugged them. That's not predatory. There's more than bro. one way to be predatory. I think nowadays. But that's not yeah, yeah, predatory. A nowadays, we're predator, predator, predator to mean like one thing, like it's, a Geppetto. It's always yeah. been a But like, a you know, there's predators thing. in the wild. It's anytime you're like hunting down your prey. And you're you, trying to take In that moment, we're yeah. one million percent. Do you qualify for the definition of predatory? Hundred percent. But in her mind, though, freak freak men can't be they can't be yeah, preyed upon. I guess like, yeah. That's that in her mind. That's what it is. Even though she literally agreed to it, knowing that she wasn't gonna give it to them, had the yeah, drugs the part. The in part her right possession to possession. drug them, possession. and also waited for them Jesus. to get passed out to then take their money. You're you're like you're doing every single step along the way. Where you're preying on men, bro. Also, like just because it's not the same. I agree, it's not they, the same. But you're still preying on somebody. She thinks because like they've probably been predators of some sort like she like, thinks she's you know, even no, in the school you know yeah but like yeah. every every prey has a predator like there's always gonna be somebody up the food chain that doesn't make you any less of one I think nowadays it just has a that's really very, really negative connotation because it doesn't yes. even mean like this it, it, yeah. fierce and like it, like, it groups you in with the rapists and, and I don't even want to name the other ones 
But yeah, it groups you. It, people don't want to be grouped in with with that because obviously those are serious, serious, serious accusations and stuff. But like, but that's not what they're saying. What they're saying is you may have not drugged them up and raped them or nothing like that, but you or, or drugged them up, raped them, and did all X, Y, and Z. But you drugged them up. You you agreed to so y'all both agreed to something. Y'all came to agreement and you plotted on a whole something whole totally different that. You guys didn't agree on. That's like, prime example. If you want to have sex with somebody and you want to use a condom and the other person don't doesn't want to use a condom and even though you told them to use a condom and they still don't, that's considered rape. To, or, or, or at, least at the very minimum, it is considered, it's considered being taken advantage of. You know what I mean? So, it's, it's a slippery slope, man. Slippery slope. Like what it used to yeah, like if, yeah. if I was in class in fourth grade niggas said like oh that that person's a, like that that's predatory like niggas is not thinking kids right they're yeah. thinking you yeah. like vicious like ruthless mm. like words that describe like the animal kingdom almost but so I see where she's coming from but I see just to let you know like it's predatory to fucking drug somebody and rob them just yes. let you know and also you trying Plot to it. justify yeah that the justification behavior is, making is it. extremely ironic coming from a woman who I'm pretty sure you would never ever ever justify anybody else's predator you sound like the you sound like a predator you you I Ironically, sound like those predators who justify yeah, raping women. women. Like, oh man, she deserved it, or da 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 da. Like, you sound like you sound like somebody. I'm gonna just justify what I did. These are freak niggas who, this hey niggas man, these niggas who say that. Yeah, this, yeah. this definitely. Charleston White. Say, oh yeah, man. Like, you just dress like this. Like, you just. You well, no, he said it. That's what do you. you no, I'm talking a, about the actual rapist. There's a there's a rapist who said I'm like she deserved sure. it. I mean, Charleston White was literally saying, yeah. yeah, man, you know, the white women, you can't yeah, do that. Like, yeah, Charleston White, them. you can't use that nigga to, like... I'm just letting you know. I mean, I'm pretty sure in some way in their mental, before they start doing that to women, they have to justify it. But I don't think it's, like, a more you deserve. It's more like a they want it. Mm. Like, how does somebody deserve that? So you think that Cardi B, when she was preying on these men, she was like, I mean, they freak, they freak nips. They That's freak so nips. funny. You know what the crazy backward part of it is? Like, those are the niggas that, fund, that funded her lifestyle. Exactly. Yeah. Like, but if you're a stripper, Definitely did, yeah, yeah, yeah. Strip club, of course they want you. Like, they're not throwing... Like, if a nigga throws thousands of dollars, like, the likelihood oh, he doesn't want more than just you shaking ass is, is pretty high. Mm -hmm. Now, if he's, like, touching you in ways you're not comfortable with, That's just tell him totally that some different. clubs where you can touch some where, like, there's no touching allowed. Like, each one has its rules, so just, For like, sure. you have to kind of create your boundaries. Some niggas might be weird and cross the boundaries regardless. Does that make him a little predatory? Depends on how far they go, but it doesn't mean you could fucking drug and rob them. I don't them. think that's pred If you, if we... At if there's a, a no-touching rule and oh, you no, start touching... Oh, no, there's a no-touching, yeah. Like, that's crossing a boundary. But if we're at a strip club where they're, they're, the rules are very loose, and I have to like discern myself between one stripper to the next. Then like at that point, I'm just it's trial and error at that point, dead ass. But like if I'm at a strip club and like, like I I'm I know you giving it up just for me to go to the to the telly and you drug me, that's crazy. You're a predator. How do you even justify that? You just justify yeah, justifying it. Justifying it made it worse. A way better justification is like you was down bad, you got in with the wrong people. Maybe then like some people can empathize with you because a lot of people go through that where you make the wrong group of friends. Well, that was that was her original statement. Remember she was saying I'm a I was down bad. I had to do what I needed to do. Right. Had to pay the bills. So of course, drugging niggas, running Drug through pockets. Now all of a sudden it's like the niggas are freaks, dog. How do we even get here? She was referring. She was referring to the Dalai Lama clip, right? Yes. And she was saying y'all gotta be careful because because she thought that that clip was like ooh, like that's a little too close of a kiss. It is. No, it for is. sure. 100%. It's, it's so it's dangerous. Very like, wicked. you got to be careful with the you know yeah, da da da. Yeah, yeah. And oh, niggas gotcha. like yeah, you even got to be careful at the strip club too because they might. <laughs> They drug you up and do X, Y, and Z. He's like, bro, it was just a joke. Oh. I wasn't actually going to do it. It was just a joke, man. Well, Cardi can't say that because she wasn't joking. She went through them niggas' pockets, bro. That's a fact. And I'm a fucking woman. And I'm a girl that's a teenager and my body got abused. I don't talk about that shit because it's like, that's another story for another time. But just the whole fact that it's like, for y'all to even try me because I want I want y'all to protect y'all children because y'all need to be more careful with y'all kids. Nah, it's not. Y'all fucking sick. And it, and it makes me feel like y'all probably predators y'all fucking selves. Okay, Cardi, mm. I don't, I'm not going to contest what she's been through. That's her life. But just because you've been through something doesn't make it okay or less predatory to drug and rob men. It just, it just doesn't just, it doesn't. It does fight. though. It, it does sense. though when you're a man. It doesn't really matter. I get it though. Like, not that I don't know what those other dudes did in the past. I don't know what they did before you. If they done something to you, I don't know. You haven't said it, so understandable. But again, 
you agreeing to do this said thing with them. First of all, you should have just said no. But you went and was like, I need to come up. I need to get this money. And then went and drugged them. That that's when you cross that boundary. And I don't think we're under we're we're I don't think we're taking accountability for the drugging part. And then we just keep reliving and keep revisiting that because you is justifiable. In actuality, there's no way to justify the fact that you drugged and robbed them. Robbing them. It's justifiable because you need the money. Drugging them up, agreeing to something and drugging them up and doing whatever after that automatically is just a no. It's just a, you just, you just wig, bro. You just did something mad egregious. Pure devilry. Like, it's just, I, I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know how, and, and you don't see it. And that's, like, that's not cool, but, like, it's just, it's going right over Right over your mata. Yeah, you like you, a, a nigga might be able to empathize with you, but that's about it. It doesn't make it less wrong. Yeah, it's wrong. You could come right. up with millions of reasons for why it could be a zombie apocalypse. That's still wrong. You could be about to die from starvation. It's still wrong. You might well, you might find a way to justify it to yourself. Well, well, we like to be fair to Cardi. She's saying that it's not a sexual manner. She just drugged them, took their money. She didn't kiss She's right. them. She didn't. She didn't do anything sexual to them. So that's. Oh, you didn't drug it all the back, please. But she. But she. She I, promised sex. I know she promised it, but she didn't do the sexual yeah, act. Yeah. So as long, I mean, in her mind, this is a predatorial sexual act. That's what she. I think that she makes. She may be referring in that regard. I know. I, so I get where long, she's coming from. No, Again, no, I, mean, I, I, get, I mean, as long as she didn't do it like sexually. Cheat on me. I'll be that guy. I'm gonna take him out. We're gonna get drunk. I'm gonna get him all. You want Valorant skins. Just how awesome would it be to have your dream skin collection where you can stop worrying? What, bro? <laughs> nah, man, we are not. Nah. Can't watch this. Can't watch this. The problem is, Cardi B, like you, you, you can't draw the line and then say these things that you said, bro. You used to say these things. Come on, come on. Oh, we. Come on. Oh, we. You He's used to the, say these things. He's pulling the clips up. It's crazy, bro. I can't watch nothing past that. She wigged out. The drugging up shit. That's light. This is this is a this is wicked. This is pure devilry. This is. This is malevolent movements, my nigga. I can't be around here for that. What are you talking about? Get you perked up. First of all, you drug you. What's up with the drugging? <laughs> it's like the dosage is going up. <laughs> I don't. I don't get it. Get them hopped up off of <laughs> perfumes. Hopped up off of profuse drugs. Have a threesome and the whole time this is son. Why? What happened? Just leave him. Why you have to? And then you gonna stay with him after you and him just ran it. And that's get back just to say you love. Nah, nope. They all wilding. Man, I hope y'all watched the end because this is wicked, bro. I didn't even know that clip was in there. I'm out, bro. She's wilding. I know. I remember Cardi used to be saying some wild ish, man. I'm not gonna lie, she used to be saying some wild, crazy junk. But this, yeah. No, nah, no, nah, she need to seek, re seek repentance. <laughs> this is, this is, this is wicked.